event's not just about for the moms, but it's about the dads too. As a father who's gone through this seven times, there are so many things I wish I would have known the first time as a, as a young captain with my wife who was just with a new baby of where I could have been more supportive, could have been more involved and done more to help. And so we want to make sure that we're connecting with those fathers as well so that they're part of the team helping those moms and helping those babies and really creating a strong family unit moving forward. A lot of dads think that they just show up, they get the baby in their arms, get a picture, post it on Facebook and that's all their responsibilities. So what I want to do when they come up to my station is I'm going to talk to them about the baby crying, about things that they can do whenever the baby's crying, swallowing the baby, burping the baby, changing the baby's diaper, things that, that don't come naturally to men. Having that person I can talk to is important because as a first time dad, we don't usually get a lot of education outside of what mom gives you or grandparents, family and things like that. So having a dad who really knows the know-how is really good to have that connection. In a situation like this, where the dads are coming to a baby expo, that really shows you the character of these dads. And I think all these babies that are, that are represented here, I think they're really set up for success. Having a child is a change for a family. It is a change for the family, not just for the mom. And it's important that dads understand how they can contribute and help be part of that experience and go through that change to their family and that growth and become good dads from the start who are active, involved, and engaged in their child's growth and development.